Business executives from 27 countries met in Port of Spain in June at the Caribbean Investment Forum, the region's biggest conference on foreign direct investment, which draws over 500 delegates each year. The most industrialized Caribbean country, Trinidad and Tobago, wants to do business with the most sophisticated investors. Investors like Scott Jones. Jones runs the local arm of Oldendorf Carriers, one of the largest dry bulk shippers in the world. A year ago, it was hard for his team to ignore Trinidad's strengths. The economy was stable, the islands boasted modern infrastructure and qualified people. Their location below the hurricane belt and close to expanding South American markets was ideal. In October, Oldendorf built a new transshipment hub 20 miles off the Port of Spain shoreline to move iron ore from Brazil to as far as China. If its downstream sector is anything to go by, Trinidad and Tobago will make good on other opportunities in agribusiness, tourism, ICT, renewables, financial services and the creative industries. InvestTT, the National Investment Promotion Agency, pitched new projects at this year's conference. They include a state-of-the-art animation studio, a resort on the island of Tobago, a hotel and marina in the northwest Chagaramas Peninsula, and a data center that could take advantage of Trinidad's low energy costs. This is one island with an economy that's much larger than its size. And the biggest, most powerful countries in the world have been paying attention. Both US Vice President Joe Biden and Chinese President Xi Jinping paid official visits to Trinidad and Tobago for trade and investment talks that ended with offers of tangible economic support. In Trinidad, the strategy is simple. Government is pumping even more money into infrastructure, building industrial parks and modernizing local ports. To beat back bureaucracy, InvestTT operates a one-stop shop for investors. It's how Scott Jones managed to be up and running within six months of partnering with InvestTT. It's how Trinidad and Tobago earned its reputation as the place to do business.